Welcome back people my people and a big hearty best IDB reviews and reviews. Hello and welcome to those who are watching this the first time. Now today we're going to jump right into it and we're going to review Echuca Distillery's Gold Agave. Not tequila, can't be tequila because the Mexicans slapped the trademark on tequila. If it's from the top northern states near the US border, it's tequila. Anywhere else it's agave spirit. So let's hear the sound of happiness. Mute sound of happiness. Now this doesn't smell like tequila. It doesn't seem to have been roasted all that much. I'm going to read the side of the bottle and just before I tip it out. And they are saying that it's crisp, tiny aroma, sweet vanilla and smoky undertones. So I've already got myself wrong. Yep, so I'm going to pour a little bit in. The room in which I am finding myself is relatively warm. It is the end of May. And we haven't really read weather because obviously I'm a t-shirt this time last year. Go and check reviews from this week last year, and I was freezing my ass off on a jumper. Um, I can certainly smell the agave. It's so it's as I've said, the spirit's already quite warm. It's high teens in the room at the moment, so. Yeah. All right. Just pulling a drop off the um, side of the bottle. Look. Yeah, there's smokiness, there's vanilla in there. Not really tasting the honey. But having said that, it's out of a chicken, and that's a long way inland from where I am. It's about 300 kilometers. Sorry. No, it's that way. Sorry. I'm directionally dyslexic at the moment. It's 42% and I'm more likely wrong on that one. Yep, no, I'm 40. So it's gone a bit light. This is going into the Philip Island iced tea that will be coming out about the same time as this one because I've ended up doing a longish review where I intended to do a short one. So if you're going to go for gold and it's not a big year, then go for Ichigo Tissori's Gold Agave and it makes lethal cocktails. Just go and watch the Philip Island iced tea made from 100% Victorian booze, no less. Thank you, people, my people, and thank you for those first door watchers for choosing Australia Aussie's best new booze news and reviews.